lesson one, we're going to learn four chords in the first line of the song. They're going to be an E minor seventh chord, an A seventh chord, a D major seventh chord, and a B minor seventh chord. Major seventh, minor seventh. We repeat it again in our right hand. That's step four. And our final step of the five-step chord building approach is adding the minor third in our right hand. And that's G. It's three half steps above the root. Here's E, our root. The interval of a ninth. The ninth is an added tone. And added tones adds a little spice to your chords. It brightens up the sound. Let's take a look in measure three. Here I've added a ninth to the D major seventh chord. Now recall fifths. You just drop the seventh and you play the fifth. Now the fifth is seven half steps above the root. Here's our root. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There it is, the fifth. Here we have an E minor seventh with left hand fifths. It's a basic E minor seventh chord and moves the rhythm along in the piece. You play the outer notes or the melody and the root on beat one and you play the inner notes which are thirds and sevenths on beat two. Okay, let's get started.